Hey y'all, this is Archangel M here with Maneater. While related to the Ciro and Spanish mackerel, the king mackerel doesn't really talk to its family and prefers that you just stop asking questions, okay? Perhaps having gone too far with her pranks and hijinks, is now the subject of a countywide shark hunt.
favorite lighthouse. Had a keeper named Emil. Always had the best core liquor. Now they got it automated. I tell you, that computer's a lot less fun to drink with. Another shark hunt draws to a close. To look at Pier 1 is to see what happens when zero risk management practices are utilized in commercial development. Pier 1's Bird Dog Grill is famous for its endless platter challenge, featuring a dozen oysters, one full rack of ribs, six sausage links, half a barbecue chicken, and 25 spicy wings. is an animal of broad dietary proclivities. Like most American cities, the founders of Port Clovis were Freemasons, and probably Illuminati, who congregated in secret UFO bases to perform Luciferian blood rituals. I don't know what that is. Maybe a rainbow trout?
has been put out. And now a dangerous army of lawless, trigger-happy sadists begin shooting anything that moves.
The Toast of the Coast, Lieutenant Shannon Sims. It's Despite increased aerial surveillance, confidence amongst tourists and locals alike is far from buoyant. Time is running out for our shark. Hunters are on the water bringing their explosives and poor impulse control with them.
recent study estimated that one out of every five fish purchased by Americans was, just like this one, caught illegally. In the 70s, abandoned bales of marijuana frequently appeared along Port Clovis's shoreline. These were colorfully referred to by locals as square grouper. Even a shark can't help but marvel at this consumerist Babylon. In its own kingdom, a shark can appear invincible. The evolutionary anomaly, the hammerhead. Shark triumphs, overcoming her opponent's clearly superior depth perception. As twilight falls, Pete is in an uncharacteristically quiet mood. It's a dangerous job. It's not something unknown to me. Well, you want to see dangerous? Look at that, yeah? That's PT-522. My daddy crewed that off of Guadalcanal. It was Navy. Gunner's mate. Pacific Theater. But when I was 16 men, came back a day later with three. Man survives all that, just to die here in the Gulf. What happened to him? Boy, you don't like me saying this. But my daddy, his granddaddy, was killed by a mega shark. I, I, I'm sorry. He's talking about a prehistoric fish that went extinct 2.6 million years ago. I seen it. Now, you were a kid. Ain't they discovering new animals all the time? Sort of. Well, not, not exactly. In lots of cases, they're just corrections of species with different names. Also stuff like misspelling. But I just say it. Maybe there are things in the water that ain't in your textbook. Stick around. Maybe you learn a thing or two this summer.
Whatever. The ocean is vast. The majority of it still remains unmapped and unexplored by mankind. Perhaps Kyle shouldn't be so quick to dismiss his father's fevered ramblings. Especially large groupers have been known to swallow sharks whole. So the bad feelings here go both ways. The peace of the grotto enables the shark to approach the world with greater confidence and effectiveness. Took my hand, all right. Get yourself ready, boy. Now we playing with power. Scaly Pete remains resolute. Where's she at? I don't know. Ah! Big enough to toss him now, ain't you? Can! Get that can! Down, sir! Pete, get 
What remains of the boat lurches, then slowly sinks to the bottom of the sea. I am an elder shark now. The shark is now an elder, and thus begins a new battle against systemic age discrimination. Which ones are... I just remembered I don't care. Hey, this has been Archangel M. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Till next time.